तो फ्रेंड्स आज हम क्वेश्चन आंसर पढ़ने वाले हैं चैप्टर नंबर वन डस्ट ऑफ स्नो फ्रॉम फर्स्ट फ्लाइट क्लास टेंथ इंग्लिश तो क्वेश्चन नंबर वन है व्हाट इज़ द व्हाट इज़ द डस्ट ऑफ स्नो एंड हम व्हाट डज द पॉइंट से हैज चेंज इज मूड एंड हाउ वाज हाउ हैज़ द पॉइंट मूड चेंज पॉइंट का मूड कैसे चेंज हुआ था तो पहला है डस्ट ऑफ स्नो मीन्स द फाइनल पार्टिकल्स और ऑफ लेक ऑफ स्नो and sudden shower in the form of dust of snow change the poet's mood the poet's mood change from sad to happy and he felt refreshed and was wanted to enjoy the rest of the day second question hai isme hamara how does the frost uh, present the nature in this poem so poet ne nature ko kaise present kiya poem mein and the following questions may help you to think of a uh, ऑफ एन आंसर सो पहला इसमें एक क्वेश्चन है वट आर दर्ड्स दैट आर ए यूजली नेम्ड इन पोएम कौन से बर्ड्स का नाम लिया गया था एंड डू यू थिंक द क्रो इज ओफन मैंशन इन द पोएम आपको लगता है क्रो का नाम लिया गया था इस पोएम में एंड वट इमेज इमेज कम्स टू यूर माइंड वैन यू थिंक ऑफ क्रो तो आपके दिमाग में कौन सी पिक्चर्स आती है जब आप क्रो के बारे में सोचते हैं आप क्या आता है आपके दिमाग में सो फ्रोस्ट पोइट ने प्रजेंट किया है नेचर को इन अ वेरी डिफरेंट मैनर इन दिस पोएम फाइन एंड जनरली अ पोइट टेक अ बर्ड्स एंड ट्रीज विच आर नोन फॉर देयर ब्यूटी एंड गुड क्वालिटीज लाइक पिकॉक पैरेट कुको अको एंड मीना एंड ट्री ट्रीज फुल ऑफ ब्यूटिफुल फ्लावर्स एंड फ्रूट्स एंड एक्सेट्रा बट हेयर द फर्स्ट हैज टेकन टोटली डिफरेंट अप्रोच and he chose a crow which is not often used in a poem and crow is uh, black in color with a very harsh voice and is believed to be a symbol of bad omen fine so uh, thinking of a crow brings a very uh, depressing and a sorrowful pictures to our mind theek hai second question hai hamara isme uh, second question tha hamara isme what was that so again what is hemlock tree and why does not poet write about more beautiful trees such as a maple or or an oak or a pine so so hemlock tree is a poisonous tree plant with a small uh, white flowers and the poet robust robert frost did choose to use an oak and a maple or a pine tree instead he chose the hemlock tree and left all the beautiful uh, trees present in the world to present in the world actually he did so to present his mood and feelings because he was feeling sorrow and uh, depressed that's why he chose to choose the uh, very uh, poisonous plant or which is not a full of beautiful so he chose the tree that is not beautiful so which is represent his mood so now the question is uh, what do crow and hemlock represent joy or sorrow so obviously sorrow and uh, what does the dust of snow that the crow shake of a uh, hemlock tree stand for yani ki jo ye line hai the uh, let me highlight this if i can so this line ka matlab kya hai the crow uh, shake of the hemlock tree iska matlab kya hai poem mein so the crow and hemlock tree represent sorrow and depression felt by the poet in this materialistic world the dust of snow is the symbol of natural uh, joy and energy yani ki dust of snow kya hai kiska symbol hai natural joy and energy ka the dust of snow that crow shake of a hemlock tree means a passing through the sad and depressing moment the poet is entering entering into into the art uh, into the time uh, full of joy and optimism fine now the third question is have you ever been time when you felt depressed or hopeless have you experienced a similar ma- uh, moment that change your mood uh, that day so you can write uh, answer of this question like uh, they have been uh, innumerable in innumerable times when i too have felt depressed and hopeless sometimes such moment was aroused by other people's behavior and attitude sometimes due to my own 
to conduct so on one occasion when i was very upset uh, i went for a walk for a walk while walking in the park i saw a girl playing with her puppy embarrassing and feeding him and this little joy that uh, they share changed my mood and i felt very felt very happy for the rest of the day and i also joined the two and played with them so yeah that's the end of the chapter hope you like it and if you want uh, full solutions of all the questions then you can uh, visit the link in the description given below thanks for watching bye bye